<laughs> Why, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to a brand new episode of Horizon Files. I am Random Ross, and this is the show where I give you the history and sort of origin on horror characters. So, as spring is now upon us, I thought it'd be fitting to do a creature that manifests in the spring. So, buckle up, as we go into the origin files of the Creeper. Creeper. First appearance, Jeepers Creepers. Last appearance, Jeepers Creepers Reborn. Horror series, the Jeepers Creepers franchise. Portrayed by Jonathan Breck and Jeroa Benjamin. Every 23rd spring for 23 days, it gets to eat. Eat as in human flesh. The Creeper is a supernatural being that resurfaces once every 23 years for 23 days in the spring, where he appears as a demonic presence with huge bat like wings and also dresses like a human sometimes, only to be seen from a silhouette wearing a long coat and a hat. The Creeper also has various weapons ranging from an axe, to a homemade ninja star, to homemade knives and such. The Creeper, whatever he consumes, becomes a part of him. If he lost a leg, all he'd need to do is eat another human's leg and it would grow back. Even his head as well. If he should ever need to lose his head, he would grow a new one by consuming another. This creature doesn't seem to have much weaknesses, as he appears to be unstoppable, and heals and massively regenerates himself. He also has a third nostril on his nose, so that he can smell his prey. His prey ranging from scared humans, kind of like Pennywise, it's like salting the meat, but also uses fear on his prey so that he can hunt them down and consume them. Sometimes, if he sees a certain person, he'll want a certain part, such as the first film when he torments siblings Darry and Trish Jen, who he wants, well, Darry anyway, for one particular thing, his eyes. The Creeper always comes out for 23 days and has a feeding frenzy and at the end of his 23 day cycle he goes back into a hibernation once again when he seems to be at his most vulnerable. Not much is really known about the Creeper's origin other than in a deleted scene of the second film in a dream sequence it was revealed that the Creeper had been around for some time in fact, thousands of years. What could this creature be? I theorize it could obviously be a demon that feeds on the flesh of humans. Not only can it consume limbs and grow them, but also essential organs as well. Of course, the only time the creeper has truly felt vulnerable is when someone knows his origin or someone knows what he is and who he is. In the third film, it's revealed that from one of his remains, when touching it, you see all you need to know about him, and that scares him too. Last time the Creeper was around was in the events of the first film, 2001, meaning that he will awaken again in 2024, which will be 
23 years next spring. The first three films take place around the days of his feeding cycle in that year. The fourth film, Jeepers Creepers Reborn, is a retelling and was not that good, but the Creeper still maintained the pretty much standards of the Creeper from the previous films and was portrayed by a different actor. In the original three films, the Creeper has been portrayed by actor Jonathan Breck, who impressed everyone at his audition. The Creeper, oh, it does not seem to have any speech, but does talk, as in a deleted scene of the first film, it is revealed that he does speak some dialogue, not much. I'm glad this part was cut from the film, as it would have took away mystique and unsettlingness from the creature. Not else is really known about this monster, but it also is skilled in engineering as it has his own rusty old truck filled with various traps and places where he stores things such as his prey. Also the creeper has a lair underneath an abandoned church which he calls his house of pain where underneath the church he has his lair decorated with bodies of his previous victims, possibly throughout the years. So, if you see the creeper, or you come across this creature, try not to fear him. If you fear this demon, he will hunt you down and find you. As I said already, it consumes fear, and sometimes only wants a certain person for a certain something from them which is not very clear until he takes it. The Creeper, however, at the end of his 23-day cycle in 2001, he was captured and imprisoned, only for 23 years later, for him nearing his cycle, he would awake again. However, survivors of family, of victims' family members, vow to come to arms this 23rd spring and prepare for the creeper. Whether we'll see a conclusion to this story is unknown, given the controversy behind the film's history, which we will not go into detail here. But yes, the creeper. Particularly fascinated by the 1929 jazz song as well, Jeepers Creepers which is also the name of the horror franchise that he is the antagonist of. And there you have it, the Horrigen Files on the Creeper. Does this creature truly give you the chills and the creeps? Does it? And also, given the timeline of the first film, it's only a year away until the creature should awaken again. Anyway, yes, let me know what you think to this down below in the comments and if you like this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up and to share with your friends and feel free to subscribe to the official Random Horror YouTube channel if you haven't already and to hit that notification bell. I've been Random Russ and this has been The Horrigen Files. So until next time, don't have nightmares.